This is an ancient green bull. It is very large. 3 kilometers long and weighs 5,000 tons. But now it was crushed by a helicopter. And it cried out helplessly. The woman saw it and tried to help. But she was not strong enough to lift the helicopter. Just then, the helicopter was suddenly taken up. And the woman looked up to see that a huge beast had appeared. He was King Kong, who was several hundred meters tall. King Kong should have been living happily on the island. But this day, the peace was broken by a group of helicopters. In the name of developing the island, they kept hunting animals on the island. And this behavior was soon retaliated. A flying tree plunged right into the helicopter. And perhaps King Kong was so hungry that he put a human into his mouth. Looking at King Kong's huge body, some people as well were frightened. But at this point, the killing had just begun. The helicopter was like a toy in King Kong's hands. And in no time at all, half of the squad was gone, and the surviving humans ran into the woods. But the crisis wasn't over. Soon a soldier was pierced by bamboo. Looking at the bamboo, it turned out to be a giant large spider. Because of the distance, the human bullets did no harm to him. Seeing one of their teammates being eaten, they realized that the spider's legs were weak and cut off all the big long legs. The spider then slumped to the ground. An old black went up and added a few shots, and the crowd was then temporarily safe. On the other hand, a single soldier encountered King Kong again, but King Kong did not mean to hurt him. He just squatted down and prepared to drink water. But then a danger seemed to be approaching in the water. There seemed to be something in the water, and King Kong felt something was wrong. He grabbed a tentacle out of the water as soon as he could. But when you looked closely, it turned out to be a giant squid. King Kong was then wrapped up in the tentacle and was about to be pulled into the water when King Kong stomped on it so hard that the squid's head was instantly exploded. Then used the power of the flood directly to rip off a section of the tentacles. So a meal of fresh squid sashimi me to hand, the rest ready to take home. But halfway a lizard, but blocked the way. But on this island, King Kong, that is the ceiling level of existence, he three times killed the giant lizards. At this time, the man has just come back from the dead, but he has not yet reacted. A piece of what actually came to life. Holy crap, it's a moving grasshopper. The man fires wildly at him, but the grasshopper doesn't fight back, and it turns out that there's a bigger crisis behind the man. At the same time, a group of people are preparing to evacuate in a boat, when suddenly one of them is grabbed by a bird, and sent to meet God right in there. The remaining men discover a large bit, and through the bones inside, they determine that this may be King Kong's ancestral tomb. At this point one of the man's cigarettes triggers an explosion, and the loud noise attracts a monster. But the monster seemed to have a bad stomach, he threw up at once, and the ground was full of mess. Then an old man sensed that something was wrong, and then just then, a soldier opened fire on the monster. But this completely anchored the monster. He started to weep people everywhere. That big mouth! Even the truck is not enough to stuff teeth. At the critical moment, a woman threw out a lighter, instantly ignited the methane gas on the ground, and finally triggered an explosion, and the monster finally died. But the old man said that this is only the smallest of the lizards, and the largest has not yet come out. This is a kind of monsters called skeleton giant lizards. They are brutal in nature and have a strong bite, and they once killed King Kong's entire family. Every time he saw them, King Kong hated them so much that he couldn't wait to bite them all to pieces. It was only when King Kong kept them down that there was a little peace in the morning. That day, ignorant humans poured gasoline into the river and they were ready to burn King Kong. Just for a moment, King Kong was covered in flames. He let out a hiss of pain, and finally his stamina fell. King Kong slowly shivered down. Just at this time, the biggest skeleton lizard appeared, because the long term are suppressed by the King Kong. Now King Kong was seriously injured. He did not dare to delay for a moment, and then from the dark to the dawn of the fight, only to see King Kong picked up a big tree, and so a stroke, a golden rod so appeared, he was like a god, against the lizard's brain thumped, indirectly to the giant lizard into a cripple. But soon the giant lizard stood up. He pushed King Kong on the ground. At this time, King Kong was caught in the human's trap, watching the giant lizard step by step. Just then the human launched an attack on the giant lizard. They finally woke up, and it was just such a moment. King Kong stood up again. He broke the chain on the body. A pendulum geared directly through the giant lizard flying. But this time, but the body of the woman was shocked down. King Kong gently fished the woman up. At this time, the giant lizard and back to fighting strength. He used his tail wrapped around the body of King Kong, with his tongue set King Kong's arm. This time, King Kong completely angry. He used the power of the flood directly to the giant lizard's tongue, as well as some of the messy things. All yent out. And so, Dang Skeleton Island Bearer finally left the box lunch. Afterwards, King Kong slowly put the woman down. He was once beaten by the human body all over the body, but at this time, but showed such tenderness, and then looked at the woman fondly, then disappeared in the valley. Just like this, the humans were finally safe, and they returned to the world.
This story tells us that King Kong is not a bad person.